Researchers at CU Anschutz could help break the cycle of obesity, starting with pregnancy. And it turns out the solution may lay in a hormone we all have in our bodies. Today, promising new research showing a hormone could be a key player in the cycle of obesity, and more specifically, may explain why expectant overweight mothers tend to have overweight babies, too. Today, almost two thirds of all American women enter pregnancy either overweight and, or, or obese. The problem with that is that these babies have a much higher in, uh, risk to develop obesity and di diabetes themselves in childhood and later in life. Enter adiponectin, a naturally occurring hormone that in high levels guards against obesity and diabetes. When the hormone was given to obese mice at the end of their pregnancy, researchers at CU Anschutz found their babies were born with normal birth weights. Specifically, adiponectin puts a break on the placenta and the function of placenta so it doesn't transfer excessive amounts of nutrients to the fetus. So could a breakthrough drug be on the horizon? Researchers say yes. One is already in the works in Japan. In the meantime, researchers are now looking at the long-term effects of adiponectin and whether it prevents problems associated with obesity later in life. It's definitely novel and gives some promise and hope for the future that we can, can better understand why these babies have problems and potentially be a foundation for, for new treatments.